Hey everyone, it's me Waka. Welcome back to my channel. Today is an awesome day because I got a package that I was waiting for like a whole month. It took me one month to gather all the items that I needed to make this video. So yes, so I had to make this video as quickly as possible. Today we are going to review slash unbox uh, items that I got from different Etsy stores. I love buying from Etsy. I see so many great indie artists out there, such as me, because I used to sell on Etsy. Currently, my store is closed since I moved from Puerto Rico to US, but I really, really hope I can open the store again. So I got few items and I purchased from three different stores. I never purchased from this store before, so I hope everything is cool. The first one that we are going to see is this one over here. The first shop that I bought an item from was called Notice Me Senpai Shop. It's made on St. Petersburg and they have very cute items. I purchased a item, a necklace that it says kawaii. They had it in blue, yellow, pink and green. I got it in pink. I have no idea which one to pick because I think all of them looks extremely extremely cute. And the necklace was just night box. I feel like that's pretty cheap. Plus the shipping. It's very cute because the seller put me some cute zombie stickers over here. You know, Halloween. He gave me a candy. That's nice. Ugh. Before looking at the item, look, I just got a ring pop. Oh my gosh, I love this so much when I was a kid and um, I still love them but this is like a Halloween theme it is marmelon, watermelon, watermelon flavor so nice! the necklace is over here, oh my gosh look at this, it's a lilac bag isn't that cute? I mean it's my favorite color, like what? Let me take a look first. Oh, I think this is made. Um, let's see, I don't know. I didn't even read what was the material of this. I just saw Kawaii and I just instantly purchased this. So, yeah. It came in a cute organza lilac bag. So cute. Now, let's take a look at the necklace. I see a little black dot on the, on the A letter. I don't know what it is, maybe it's dirt because this is handmade, but oh my gosh, so cute, just simple but cute. Let me see if you can see very well. There's a black dot there, but it's so cute. I thought this was more bigger, but that this is perfect and it comes with the silver necklace and here is the back of it I forgot the name of this, it's just whatever the name is, it looks nice the material of this, I don't know it looks like hot glue for some reason it says that it's made out of a resin and the necklace length is 18 inches, so that is pretty nice. This seller also sells other cute items, so it is a new store that I've never seen before. So if you have a time, check this store out. It sells very cute accessories. I think I never purchased a necklace from a shop before. I wish the seller made this in Lila because it would have been perfect. I think it's the perfect size. I really like it. It doesn't look extremely cute with this top, but yeah, I like it. I like it a lot. Also, something that I uh, did not mention is that I purchased this on October 7 and it arrived in October 22. So, the next item is over here. It's from the brand named Ugly Plants. She has a uh, and Instagram I follow her and she posts so many cute so many cute stuff and I've been wanting to get a this pin that I'm gonna show you soon 
for a long time and I just like Ugh! I just decided to purchase it now that I was making this video so yeah I spent 43 plus the shipping which was three dollars the first item the pin cost me ten dollars and the t-shirt cost me 30 because it's well it's I think it's made to order so let's take a look as you can see, Ugly Plan has so many adorable, adorable, adorable items in the store. You guys really should check it out. Super, super cute. This video is not sponsored by any means. I'm just doing this because I just really like to support indie shops. So yeah, let's take a look at this one. I'm trying to look for the pin fur because it's small. So my gosh, I just saw it. It's so freaking adorable. Ah. This is my first. This is the first time that I ever purchased a pin from an indie store, or I think it's the first time that I ever purchased a pin like overall. Is this so adorable? Headshot pin. Like, oh my gosh. I don't know if you can see it. So shiny. It's a birthday hedgehog. It's so cute. Like, oh my gosh. I love it so much. It's a very cute enamel pin. And here on the back, it says Ugly Plants. Uh, you have the website, uglyplants.com, and Instagram, lol, lolstasia. I don't know if you can see. I follow her and I just love everything that she makes. This is so freaking adorable. Oh, I really love the presentation. This is something that I wish the first shop had. The first shop didn't come with any business card, so it would have been nice that the seller has something like a business card or something like this, but it's okay. And let me see, where should I put this on? I didn't notice, but the pin is actually like a copper, copper crawler. It's not like gold or anything like that. It's copperish. But it's so cute. Oh my god. I love it. I love it, love it, love it so much. He's not gonna hang out on this sweater forever. I'm gonna I'm gonna see where should I put it. But I just wanna show it off because he's so adorable. And the other item that I got from her is this t-shirt. Let's take a look yeah it's the same as i saw on her shop and we have it here it's pure black and it's pastel it's so adorable and it's going to look so awesome with this wig so that is awesome so we have chef bird um pas pas pastel. my french is not good so patissier, Swiss all day, bon appetit, too, and menu. And we have very cute desserts over here. The only one that I know is macaroons. I don't know this, <laughs> but it's so so adorable. I really like the design, and I can feel it. I can feel the print. The t-shirt is in all style apparel and active wear, classic, and I choose a size medium. Here's a close-up. So, so cute. I gotta try this on. So this is how the t-shirt looks on me. If I had chosen a size small, it would not fit through my hips. As you can see here, it's already a little bit tight on my hips. And if I would have picked a size large, it would have been extra huge on me. And it would have looked kind of like a man t-shirt size. And this would have been like up to here probably. So I feel like it's the perfect length. But it doesn't matter because I can wear this t-shirt uh, inside of the of this skirt. Like something like this. It still will have look cute. You cannot see too much the bird's face, but it's okay. But it really, it really looks so good with this wig. 
like oh my gosh and i love did i said before that i love how vibrant this pink and um, pastel colors are maybe it's the black t-shirt that make them like pop out very much but they look extremely cute the t-shirt itself is actually comfortable um i don't feel like it's too hot like compared to my wig this the, the wig is more hotter than the t-shirt so i get that's probably a good thing about this again i love how it looks with this wig and the third shop is from the brand mare booney baby they have so many cute clothing like i wanted to purchase so many things but i have no idea about the sizing so i just wanted to guess one thing just to try it out and see what's my size but all their dresses they have the same size chart so i just have to be sure if the one that i pick that i think i choose x large is the perfect size for me this one are based in hong kong but they just have so many so many cool clothing like it's crazy so so cool i didn't mention before it's just too much information for me <laughs> that ugly plants it's based on Brooklyn's. So, also, I ordered from Ugly Plants on October 7th and I got them October 22. It says that it was delivered. Marbuni Baby had so many, so many cute styles. This is what I was waiting for the whole month because it's from Hong Kong. Uh, it's quite heavy, actually. It's just one dress. So, let's take a look. The thing, well, you're gonna see. It's the cutest thing um, ever. I just hope it fits me right. Oh my gosh, so cute! Oh my gosh, is that my 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 real name over here? It comes in this packaging, and I find that super super awesome. I don't know if you already guessed it, but it's Alice in Wonderland. It's so cute. Oh my gosh, it's so cool. This plastic is very thick, so that is awesome. Oh, the fabric feels so, so nice. I think this is a bigger size. I think I should have picked size large. No! The quality is amazing. I don't see it like it doesn't look blurry at all it looks really 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 nice I purchased one dress with this type of material this feels like a, the bikini type of material once on Aliexpress and when I when it came I saw that the design was kind of blurry but this one it's not like that let me show you this is how the dress looks It's super cute. I don't know if you can tell. The design it's all over the dress, which is something that I love. So freaking cute. But it looks really big. Oh my gosh. Well, who knows, right? Maybe I will have to sew it. Maybe. I don't know uh, but I really love how nice the quality is it's very stretchy this size is too big for me now I'm sure of it because I thought that this dress wasn't too stretchy you know like a very thick kind of bikini uh, material fabric but no it is quite stretchy like it's insanely stretchy Let's see on the waist. It's super, super stretchy. Mm. Oh my gosh. Let's try it out. So, the dress. Like I said, it's big on me. I don't know if you can tell, but you can see it over here. It's quite big on me, surprisingly. Um, I have quite a lot of room on my waist and 
as you can see, it's very long for me. I don't know what to do because I cannot send this bag. This is something also that you gotta keep in mind because this is made to order. You cannot send this bag. Um, they do not make any, um, they don't do exchanges or stuff like that. So that's why I wanted to be completely sure what I was gonna do. <laughs> but I mean, it looks cute. I think it's still wearable. I might have to, I don't know, put some layers maybe. Um, now I know that I am definitely a size large. The fabric, it's, it feels so nice and it's very comfortable. Like, I mean, it's big enough for me. I really like it. It looks so, so plain without petticoat. I love how this dress looks with the petticoat as in the picture. I have a petticoat over here and I'm gonna try it out with it to see the difference because right now it just looks flat like and extremely long also I don't have a lolita in the petticoat I only have this so it might not make a huge difference so keep in mind of that it looks kind of weird because the petticoat is short so it looks extremely weird <laughs> we have this situation going on here honestly with a petticoat it makes a huge difference I wanted to get a Lolita petticoat that was one of the things that I wanted to purchase from my last towel haul but you know what happened my package got lost there was a whole outfit of Lolita and everything I lost it so thank you FedEx as I was saying the dress is big on me but it's still wearable I can maybe sew this a little bit so this part it doesn't look as big but the dress is still very long for me on sew all this and maybe sew the skirt maybe I may have to sew all the dresses because I'm just short I really kind of wait to have more dresses from them because they are extremely cute, very good quality. So guys, what do you think about these cuties? Honestly, like I said, I love the dress, but it's quite big on me. I think I might have to sell it maybe on Depop or Poshmark. Please let me know because I would really would love to have this dress. Um, in my size and I don't want to start cutting the dress just to make it fit me it's very cute and I want to risk it so if you are ex large and you love this dress please let me know because you're gonna help a smaller youtuber like me to sell something that is completely new it's just that this size is too big on me and it's very cute honestly and it's in good hands so guys what was your favorite item of this haul my favorite has to be this dress even though i love the hedgehog pin i mean i cannot deny that this dress is super cute the quality of the of the design is amazing it's not blurry at all and i think that for 34 you have a very very cute design and if you add the petticoat the long petticoat this dress is gonna look like it costs a lot more and this will just look so cute with a lot of Lolita accessories and it even looks cute just with this simple wig and hair accessory so let me know in the comment below which one was your favorite item also something that I want you guys to let me know is that if you like me to keep uh, searching for cute accessories or anything cute from indie Etsy stores. Let me know in the comment below if you want me to keep doing this type of videos. Also, don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel if you like this type of videos. Don't forget to also follow me on Instagram because I tend to post pictures there and I tend to post stories letting you know what's going on with my channel or I just tell you what's going on with me. Thank you very much for watching and I hope to see you guys next time. Bye bye!